Breaking news right now. We have just learned the name of the man murdered in Midtown overnight. Let's get to Dan Kennedy. He just got these brand new details this morning from investigators joins us yeah. now live. Dan, do they think this is drug related? Amy, yes, they do. They are investigating this as a possible drug motivation behind this deadly shooting. They say it was targeted. It was not random. And the victim this morning has been identified as 24-year-old O'Shea Rutledge. Now, this is what the scene looked like a little earlier this morning. Again, all this happening before 10 o'clock last night when police say Rutledge was shot in his car. He tried driving down 18th Avenue North right around Church Street, tried driving for help. That's when he crashed into uh, this fence. And then ran out of his car and collapsed outside of a business as he tried running for help. Police arrived. They took him to the hospital where he was pronounced dead shortly thereafter at Vanderbilt University Medical Center. No suspect information at this time. Police are going to be going door to door to a lot of these businesses once they start to open up because this is on a very busy Church Street where the shooting took place at a pretty busy time last night. They're going to be checking to see if there's any surveillance pointed at the road that might lead them to any kind of uh, suspects in this case a little later today. But as of now, we don't have anything to pass along. Again, 24-year-old O'Shea Rutledge is the victim in this case. I'm talking with the woman who identifies herself as his girlfriend on Facebook right now. She says she got the news at about 11 o'clock last night. She describes him as a caring, loving person, always helping people out. She says their family's devastated, and she wants, quote, the dude who killed him behind bars for life. We're going to keep you updated on this story throughout the day on NewsChannel5.com. Reporting live in Midtown, Dan Kennedy, News Channel 5.